Zhong Mantian is a senior designer at the China Garment Design Research Center. One of his avocations is collecting shoes. Over the years, his home has been transformed into a veritable footwear museum. Zhou Mantian's fascination with shoes goes back to the 1960s when he went to work in Shanxi province. The city where he was employed is considered the birthplace of traditional embroidered shoes. There, Zhou Mantian learned to see beyond the utilitarian value of shoes and to appreciate the aesthetics of footwear. In the designs on the soles and vamps, he began to see traditional Chinese values. These are China's traditional embroidered shoes. What really matters is the design. This design is composed of garlic, leek, and red pepper. These vegetables and spices symbolize acumen, discretion, and economy in the Chinese tradition. Those qualities are considered the most admirable in the local culture. Most of the time, the embroidery on shoes reflects the most cherished wishes of farmers. That includes fertility, marriage, and family harmony. A farmer's life usually can be chronicled according to the number of shoes he has worn. Begrimming with the embroidered shoes, Zhou Mantian embarked on a more ambitious adventure in the world of footwear. This shoes were very difficult to find in Shanxi when I was selling them. Why? Because there is a bell attached to the shoes. At first, I thought the bells were intended to create the music while the wearer walked. But the owner told me I was wrong. She said local women are required to act in the most genteel and discreet manner. And so the lady should never allow the bell to make the slightest sound as she walked. At first, she refused to sell the shoes to me. But I found that she was so poor that she couldn't afford a box of matches. So I bought her a box of matches as an exchange for the shoes. In Shanxi, shoes are considered part of the family legacy. Most people are reluctant to part with their shoes. As a result, Zhou Mantian often to butter using his rations of food and other materials. Over four decades, Zhou Mantian has collected more than 4,000 pairs of shoes. These are apparently from Italy. The image of the Leaning Tower appears on the side. Actually, the shoe can serve as a drinking receptacle. These were bought in Hollywood in the United States. You can see the popularity of high heels among American women. These are the replications of a pair of shoes once owned by Marilyn Monroe. The shoes made her even more glamorous. From looking at the shoes, it's easy to see how times have changed over the decades. At Zhou Mantian's home, images of shoes are everywhere. Wind chimes, lights, and even the furniture take on the outlines of shoes.